what tip would you give to you know a parent who has an elementary, a middle, even a high schooler who's just got that early curiosity or even the dream? Yeah, so first you follow Good Beat. <laughs> so you can see our experiments, our science Let's experiments go. there and get some ideas. It really, it takes an intentionality of being the parent and helping mm -hmm. guide them. It takes, it, well, let me, let me give you an example. It can be as simple as watching a science show together. So just sitting down and having, using your screen time well to really engage and ask questions and find out new activities that you can do together, whether that's on YouTube, whether that's watching a science show on Netflix. And then you also should look to your resources around you. So there are many science camps, engineering camps, and things that your city will offer or your school will offer. A lot of times they have programs that you can get your child involved. One of the national organizations is National Society for Black Engineers Junior. So they call it Nesby Junior. And so you can look up and see if there's a chapter in your area and what organize, organized activities and projects. They do robotics competitions and math competitions. And just, it really takes an intentionality to be aware, to know, to look for those resources to help your child.